In wake of the sweeping revelations by the United States Department of Treasury, the government of Ghana has sent the Permanent Secretary of the Ministry of Labor, May Thomas, on leave with immediate effect. Thomas was featured in a press statement issued by the U.S. Treasury Department as linked to corruption with Guyanese businessmen Nazar and Azruddin Mohammed. According to a statement from the Guyana government, it pointed out that it has taken careful note of a press release issued by the United States Department of Treasury on the 11th of June 2024, which informed three Guyanese nationals and entities has been sanctioned by the Department's Office of Foreign Asset Control. The government said that based on the information referenced in the press release, the Ministry of Finance and the relevant statutory agencies, including the Guyana Revenue Authority, will be requesting additional information on the matters highlighted with a view of adding local law enforcement agencies. The government noted that it takes very seriously the claims contained in the press release and will continue to engage the relevant United States entities on these matters. The government of Ghana will continue to work with the United States government on all matters of mutual interest, including the respect for the rule of law and order.